Hello Cancers, so this is your weekly reading. I'm going to start with the tarot and see what's going on. Okay. So universe, what's the current energy between Cancers and person that's on Cancer mind for January 25th to February 1st, Six of Wands. Okay. Someone feeling left on the code. Um, by you, okay, I remember in your last reading, someone is, like was really missing you, okay, let's see what else I'm getting. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, we would like to say to Cancer, Five of Swords, so this person is missing you, but at the same time, I feel like they're feeling away, <laughs> okay, if this is someone who's petty, okay, very petty, what they would like to say, they want to say something petty, okay, they want to say something that's petty, Okay, because they're in their feelings. <laughs> so what they keep ahead is the king of wands in reverse. Okay, so I feel like this is not really hidden, basically. It, this is just someone who's not acting upon it, someone who's not about it. <laughs> okay, so you see what I was getting. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, how do they feel about Cancer? Six swords in reverse, but they want to resurface. Okay, they want to return. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what is their true feelings for Cancer for January 25th to February 1st? The devil, they have this unhealthy obsession, <laughs> this unhealthy bond, okay, with you. They stuff on you, look at that. They have a lot of emotions too, because they have the Ace of Cups. But I feel like it's because they need to work on themselves, it can be unhealthy, because they might be very focused on you, very obsessed. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what is their intentions with cancer to balance things out? But at first, <laughs> it's to balance things out. But like when they first talk to you again, it's like they want to say something a little bit snappy, a little bit um, petty, a little bit. <laughs> and then to balance things out, okay? So you can see how this person is toxic at times, or they talk all the time. <laughs> Universal person that's on cancer mind. What actions would they take with cancer? Eight of Cups. So I feel like they're going to try one more time. Um, and let's just say you really don't want nothing to deal with them. I feel like they're going to give you your space, okay? Because I feel like you did break up with them, okay? That's what I'm saying. So they're going to try one more time. It could be this week, but I'm not fully getting this week. I feel like it's going to be sometime probably in February. And then once they see that that's not going to work, they're just going to give you your space. You'll see if it's going to be like the last time they're going to be reaching out universe cup by the eight of cups universe cup by the eight of cups knight of swords no that's not gonna be the last time <laughs> they're just gonna give you your space for a while <laughs> okay so this person signed happy gemini energy okay um could be a libra could be aquarius there's some capricorn here um there's some scorpio here too let's see And also please give the audio. The audio might not sound that great, okay? Other signs was going off on me. <laughs> but the audio not sounding that great, but it's because here it echoes a lot, so I'm sorry for that. So let's see. Universe, give me a four card spread. What's going to happen in Cancer's love life? Okay, so there's single, there's hermit, codependency, the truth, and it's a freestyle card. Jenna energy is the emperor. I feel you guys are gonna break up for it with them. A lot of you guys for good, okay? Because you may feel like this person is like too controlling. Um, they're very codependent, okay? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You want someone who's actually your true divine masculine or your true divine feminine. You want that emperor or that empress. You're not gonna settle with <laughs> um, karmics, basically. Let's see. Okay. So, universe. Universe. 
Give me a three cards, but I will message to see how for cancer. So there's Zell, Universe, Mace, and my cards. We'll message to see how for cancer. I got a lot of cards. So there's doubt, humor, self esteem, health, success, loneliness, and growth. Yeah, so I feel like this is you choosing you. Okay, you know that's the best way um, where it can lead to a more fulfilling life. You're not going to be dealing with any drama. Okay, you're going to be choosing peace. Okay. Okay, let's look here. Let's see what they would like to say. Okay, so universe, give me a two cards by the person that's on cancer. I would like to say to cancer. So we got discipline in reverse. What they like to say is that they're off the rocker, <laughs> okay? And they need to work on their, their self more, okay? Because I feel like this is someone who likes to go through many extremes. They might have a codependent. Um, they may be very codependent, okay? Um, and they need to just work on themselves. I feel like they're aware of themselves. They are, it's just like they don't like to do the inner work. So let's look here. These cards want to come out. Let's see. We got trumpet. We got three of swords, the devil again, the world, page of planet. I feel like you guys are closing out this because you see it's very unhealthy. Even though this person wants to reconnect with you, you're closing that out. Okay, that's insane. All right, so you guys, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Cancer? Perfect timing. Universe, give me three my cards. What messages do you have for Cancer? The situation will prove it's up to you and remain positive. Yeah. So I feel like with them, there's potential here, probably. <laughs> but they have to work on themselves, okay? Um... They're aware of their problem. At least that's that's good that they're aware of it. They just need to not be lazy. <laughs> okay? Romance. I feel like, yeah, if they work on themselves, then there's probably potential. Okay? Okay. So, let's see if there's any random messages. This is that like to have random messages? It's universe me if we're card spread. What messages do you have for Cancer, Rescuer? Probably this is someone who's abusive. If this is someone who's abusive, you need to get out. Um, clean, definitely, okay. Then there's Father, Damsel, and Healer. Yeah, so probably this is someone who's abusive. It doesn't matter what type of abuse. It could be emotional abuse, physical abuse. Get out. Um, this is like um, learning, you know, knowing better, doing better. And I feel like you guys are doing that. Okay. Let's see here. Okay, so universe, give me a two card spread. What messages do you have for Aries? There's Aries. What messages do you have for Cancer? You like me myself. Universe, give me one more card. Soul's truth. Being with discomfort. Yeah. So I feel like this was, you being in this connection was like eating at your soul. And again, if this is someone who's abusive, it was really affecting you. It doesn't matter what type of abuse. Um, it was affecting you and it's trying to set you on the right path of getting out. Okay. Um, so definitely do. Being with discomfort. At times of discomfort, I encourage to seek my soul essence, which is clear, pure, and luminous. Okay, then there is uniquely myself. I trust that who I am is perfect for my unique journey and my soul path. And then there's soul truth. I listen to my soul simple truth and allow my life to unfold naturally. Okay, so that's the reading that I have for you, Cancer. Is thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a person with me at queenfitterro at gmail.com.